But first, only on 11 Alive, a daycare owner accused of battery. The charges leading other parents to come forward sharing their own concerns. When Caitlin Ross started digging, she discovered complaints going back more than a decade and evidence that the state tried to revoke the daycare's license, yet it still is open tonight. Class is still in session today at the Hold Heidi Academy here in Woodstock. And while the director is not allowed on campus after her arrest, I talked to parents who pulled their kids out who say they want the whole thing shut down. <laughs> She's a little artist. She loves to paint. Three-year-old Nora's art hangs on the walls. The joy she brings her parents is clear. She is awesome. She's smart. She's funny. She's so silly. Yeah. Courtney and Stefan Allen thought she was thriving at Hold Heidi Academy in Woodstock until this March when her mom went to pick her up and the daycare director said they couldn't find her. Tammy stood up and she walked around the school and didn't see her and then she went to the exterior door, unlocked it and you know, about 20 feet away, there was Nora. They immediately pulled Nora out of the daycare and Stefan posted about what happened on Facebook. That's when dozens of other parents and former employees started sharing their experiences as well. A whole bunch of people started coming out of the woodwork, yeah. telling their experiences. 11 Alive found complaints against the center going back 12 years. A former employee filed a written complaint alleging abuse and harsh punishments against children younger than one. Another mom shared photos with 11 Alive of her toddler son bleeding from the face, his tooth knocked out. She took those pictures to police. Then last week, the daycare owner and director, Tammy Dorston, was arrested for allegedly grabbing another little girl by the face and leaving marks with her nails. Just uh, disgusted that somebody can treat another, a child like that. 11 Alive discovered a previous investigation in December of 2021 that led the state to revoke the daycare's license. Dorston appealed that decision, which is how the center is still open now as that appeal is reviewed. The Allens think Hold Heidi Academy should be shut down for good so everyone can move on, their daughter included. I want her to be happy, just feel loved. Don't want her to think that something is her fault. I called the daycare center today and they told me Tammy Dorston was not available for comment. I emailed her as well, but so far have not heard back.